everybody. Welcome to Bible in a Year. Fun Friday with me and Fred. We uh, picked him up from boarding. And um, honestly, I picked him up a couple days ago. And he has been so um, discombobulated, I, I guess is the best word. He um, he was there for probably close to two weeks. And as all of the followers know, he's never caged. His doors are always open. So he was caged for close to two weeks with bird friends. He had a lot of friends there. He had Connie. You remember Connie and Albie? Does Albie say hi, baby? And he loves talking to all of his friends. And, um, you know, he always has a really good time, but he is always caged. And so this was kind of an extra long uh, visit over at boarding. And so when I picked him up, he was a wreck, honestly. The poor baby. He was a wreck. He was so sad. And I think he thought that I was gone forever. Did you think that? And then on top of it, we did a wing trim because he was kind of flying around the house or not around the house. He would leave his cage. He would fly to the kitchen and then wrap back around to his cage. So, you know, he was just having some fun. He wasn't trying to get out the door or anything. But if the door was open, who knows what this guy would do. So I said, yeah, go ahead and trim his wings. Normally we trim them a little bit long so that if he does get off his cage, he can, he doesn't just fall to the ground. He'll um, have a little bit of flight and just kind of glide down to the floor. But, um, I think maybe there might have been some miscommunication over the holidays or something, and they they really, 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 really cut his wings. I think this is called a baby cut. <laughs> so he is really upset about that. Um, for those of you who follow, you'll remember he usually has blue feathers off of his wings, and they have been cut off. So anyways, that was kind of the delay on a video. He has been out of sorts, but um, he's back and we're just kind of kicking back, having some downtime, getting reacquainted. I have no clue if birds have a long memory. I'll tell you what, when he came home that first day, I was pretty confident that he had no clue who I was. It was a little sad and my feelings were hurt, but we're okay now. So I'm just checking in with everybody. I know that there are people who love him. There should be a better video for next week. Um, my fingers are crossed that he'll kind of snap out of it. I have a feeling when he gets his wings back, that's when he'll snap out of it. He is really mad that he doesn't have his wings. But that's okay. They grow back. We go with the flow, right? We do. Have a wonderful weekend, everybody. Please hug your loved ones. It takes like two minutes. And it feels so good to hug them, look at them, and say, I love you. Have a great weekend, and I will see you tomorrow. Can you say goodbye, Fred? Because they're all here for you. Can you say goodbye? A kiss? Aw, oh, he's going to go night-night. We'll see you tomorrow, everybody. Bye.